So this video is about an issue that's plagued many Trex owners and it's the OEM pannier, the uh, adventure type pannier and the fit and the height in particular of this pannier on the Trex. So here is the pannier, it's actually a jivvy pannier that's been uh, branded by Triumph quite interestingly, so it's a very nice pannier. Interestingly this is rated at 5 kilograms where the, uh, the jivvy is rated at 10 and uh, I honestly don't know why that is. So here's the bike with the standard OEM rail on, as you can see, um, and here is the pannier on the bike. And as you can see, the height of the pannier is almost the same height as the passenger seat. This has given a lot of owners uh, issues with fit of uh, pillion. Um, I haven't heard of, of people have any issue, obviously, without um, who ride without pillion, but certainly I ride with pillion, and this is interfering with my son's leg on the peg as well as um, the height of the pannier and, and it interfering with the top of his thigh. So here's the jivvy mount. So this is the Givy or jivvy OEM mount. And as you can see, it's a lot lower and a lot further back. And I think this is the solution I'm looking for. So I tried to fit the jivvy mount to my Triumph pannier and it, and it wouldn't latch. And, and that was a little bit frustrating. Uh, and when I looked, there's actually uh, two lugs at the top of the pannier, as you can see there. And actually, in the uh, the Jivy uh, OEM mount, there's only one lug. So if you look at the Triumph mount, you can see the two lugs on the Triumph mount in the centre of the picture there. So what I did was I unbolted the Triumph or the Jivy mount off the Jivy frame. And you can see you have to be a little bit careful. There's two very small, small springs in this spring assembly that could fall out. So you just be a little bit careful when you do this, if you wish to. You can see the springs there. And then simply the top rail just lifts off. So it's a very simple task. Two bolts, as you can see, lying on the bench there. And, and you simply lift the assembly off. I then fitted the uh, Triumph assembly to the Jivy, uh, the Jivy OEM rail. Then I fitted the, the rail back to the bike. As you can see, it went on pretty well. I had to do a little bit of fettling, but uh, it went on well. And you can see the, the height difference there in the two rails, left and right. I then fitted the, the pannier back onto the bike, and as you can see, it's significantly lower than the pillion seat, and also further back. So from the footrest, although this isn't the best shot, from a foot standpoint, there's far more room for the leg to actually sit on the pedal and then clear the pannier. So that's it. I hope this works for you guys. Enjoy. 